the first thing you need to do is create a new part once you've created a new part you need to create a 2D sketch you're going to select the XY plane and I'm going to draw a rectangle I need to start at the origin and draw up my box will be 3 tab 3 zoom out I have a 3 by 3 inch block this is going to be your material I'm going to extrude it two inches and I want to make sure I extrude it backwards and this is going to help you later on once you start tooling so I type in two I'm going to go ahead and hit enter there now I'm going to sketch on this plane and what I want to sketch is a circle I'm just going to create a simple circle box here and sometimes if you go around the center here it'll snap to the center 1.5 by 1.5 and when I start creating my circle if you look at your dimensions you need to give it a 0.125 offset around the edge of the stock I do not want my circle touching the edge I want it to be in a little bit and so that means I need to put it at 2.875 go ahead and hit enter there okay actually sorry escape I need to put it at 2.75 because I need 0.125 on either side there I'm going to go ahead and hit check now I'm going to extrude this and I'm going to extrude the outside of it and I'm going to extrude it down this way and if you look eh, the base height is one inch and actually it just happened to be exactly one inch so that is going to be this right here is going to be the outside of my box so now I need to draw the inside of my box so I select this um, surface and I'm going to create a new sketch and I'm going to create an inner circle here so I come up to my circle and this inner circle if the wall thickness is 0.25 that means that this circle is going to be point two whoop sorry two point five enter sorry I screwed up once again that is two point two five enter there we go now that is giving this a wall thickness of point two five and just to confirm if I draw my dimension here to that 0.25 so I'm correct so finish sketch go ahead and accept the uh... okay so now this is going to be what we are cutting out for the inside of the box so I'm going to extrude this I'm going to extrude it down I need a um, what do you call it? a floor thickness of 0.125 so that will mean this will be 1.875 hit enter okay so now that is hollowed out now what I need to do is a lip so I'm going to create another new sketch this time I'm just going to click the offset button I'm going to click this I'm going to drag it out and then I'm going to dimension it and it needs to be 0.125 I'm going to hit enter I'm going to there and I'm going to extrude the outside of that and I'm going to extrude it down and if you look at your dimensions that um, is 0.125 that is the lip height there and so that is the base of my box it has the lip it, it has um, the actual box part where you would keep your stuff and then the walls so now what I need to do is draw my lid on the opposite side here so I'm going to click that side I'm going to go to new sketch and I want the exact dimensions so I'm going to use a little tool 
called project geometry select that and then I'm going to select what I want to project so watch when I click on this edge and I come back around it projected it onto the back okay so now when I go to finish sketch I'm going to extrude and I'm going to extrude this outside down and I'm going to extrude it down 0.75 so this is for my lid and that is not right I'm going to undo that I'm going to extrude again I'm going to select just that come down it's going to be 0.75 hit enter and that looks a lot better now so this is the same diameter as this so that they will be flush when my uh, lid gets placed onto my box now what I need to do is create a new sketch and I need to hollow out the inside of the lid a little bit so that it um, has a lip so I am going to look over here I need the outside diameter so I'm going to project geometry select that it got projected then I'm going to offset it I'm going to offset it up a little bit and the reason I'm offsetting it is so that it has it's able to slip down over that lip you want to make sure that this offset is about 0 .003 that will make it tight enough that it doesn't fall off but loose enough that you can fit it over top of that I'm going to go ahead and hit enter there I'm then going to zoom in I'm going to hit the escape key to get out of anything I'm in select that inside circle and hit delete finish sketch I'm going to go to extrude and I'm going to extrude these inside I'm going to extrude it the opposite way and if you look on your dimensions I'm going to extrude it 0.13 and the reason I'm extruding it 0.13 is it is giving it a height of 0 0.005 or point zero yeah point zero zero five higher than the lip thickness so that it doesn't hit that so I'm going to go ahead and hit OK and there you go I've just created my box hollowed out has a lip right here created my lid this lid is the exact same diameter as this my lip for my lid is 0 0.003 bigger than the lip over here so that it can fit and that is it